This neo-family of arachnids is characterized by the presence of a shell which they grow early in development. Descendants of erythraeid mites, who typically have a parasitic lifetime as newborns then grow into free-living predators, testugenids have evolved to specialize in one or the other. Mitites Nujdani specializing his lifelong parasites and Boronits specializing his lifelong predators. All members in this family have lost some of their limbs over time. Mitite Sticking to the early parasitic lifestyle of their ancestors, adult mitites evolved pheromones that attract predators so that they get eaten whole. Thanks to the protection of their shell, they can survive digestive juices while tucked in, and to combat the lack of oxygen, they enter a state of minimal activity, using up oxygen stored in the shell. When the host starts developing eggs, chemical signals trigger a response in the dormant mitites, who then locate the host's eggs and inject their own eggs on them. They lay eggs with their rotund pink hypostome, and then use their specialized fused shell acera to deliver it inside the host's egg. This shell acera is so elongated and flexible it looks like another leg. In fact, while outside a host they use it like a fifth leg. It even has the same pink colored tip as the true legs. This is likely a strategy to appear inoffensive to potential hosts, they will only see legs and think it's safe to eat. Taxonomy, Kingdom, Animalia, Phylum, Arthropoda, Class, Arachnida, Subclass, Akari, Order, Trombidiformes, Family, Erythraeidae, Neofamily, Testogenidae, Neosubfamily, Quadrupedinae, Genus, Mythobius, Species, Infiltrates. Cloaking Baronit Baronits specialized into a sit and wait predatory lifestyle, evolving their shell into bright eye shaped patterns to both scare bigger predators and entice curious prey to get closer. Due to this relatively laid back lifestyle, they accumulate fat easily and are able to survive without successful catches for several months. Their hypostome is also notorious for being able to elongate very rapidly, using it as a skewer to capture and kill prey. This is possible due to a rod-like chitin structure that connects the inside of the hypostome to the back of the baronet's shell. When this rod is retracted, it stores kinetic energy and is then locked in place by a gear-like system. When they spot a prey, they can release the rod, making the hypostome extend great lengths at high speed. After this action, the creature must take some time to retract back the rod for a subsequent attack. Taxonomy, Kingdom, Animalia, Phylum, Arthropoda, Class, Arachnida, Subclass, Akari, Order, Trombidiformes, Family, Erythraeidae, Neofamily, Testogenidae, Neosubfamily, Quadrupedinae, Genus, Transpungia, Species, Reclusiva. Ujidani Ujidani are the smallest members of all present testogenids. They are not the exception though. Mites are generally of minute sizes. Balronits and mitites are the ones with unusual dimensions. Ujidani retains the average size of their relatives as well as six legs. Two more than the more derived members but still less than the original eight of all arachnids. Of particular note the shell of an Ujidani covers the entire hypostome, this is likely an adaptation to their plant-sucking lifestyle. Some stems are particularly tough and reinforced, so having a sheath of tough chitin around their hypostome might let them access sap from plants they otherwise wouldn't be able to.